Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Sunshine Eclipse. In the last episode, we got a good amount of shines. We also got to see that we had a good opportunity to go to Rico Harbor and Gelato Beach. So I think today we're gonna grab these two blue coins here, and then I think we're gonna go to let's go to one of the newer levels. Since I kind of found one from, from going to Bianco Hills, where that train station was. I'm kind of cur curious to know if that's like a new level, or if that's like something completely different. But let's jump in. Okie dokie. Mario's like so enthusiastic. Even in a bad situation, he's like, shoot. Ew. Who pooped this much? Gross. I'm, I'm honestly surprised that they didn't like, do anything with this like I, th I thought this would have been like something that would have opened up also there's no music that's interesting I'm gonna run down this path why is there no music that's weird I don't know how to feel about this all right I'm also kind of curious so these this this guy jumps like throws you off what does this guy do what is does he throw me off to my dad said he'd come back home this week He's always so busy. He's on staff at Warship Island. Dad told me not to tell anyone, but there's a secret base there. If you bump into him, maybe tell him I said I love him. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> He's got a new shipment of durians from Yoshi Village. Is that a new island too? We gotta load them into these big tanks down there. Feels like a time of waste though. The tanks are always getting jammed, so what's the point? My bag is gonna kill me after this shift. Oh, poor guy. So what happens if we get on this train? It's blocked off. Can we get onto the train? Don't seem like it. Oh wait, we can, I think. Oh, we can. Oh. Rico, Serena, Erto. Erto Rock. Trading Tribulations. Let's see what this is about. Whoa. Hello there. I have an important favor to ask of you. Me and my son want to listen to awesome music. However, I couldn't find good speakers in the marketplace. If they give you five coins, could you figure out how to get the speakers? You can? Sweet. There's a lady who sells items for cheap. Okay. She should have something to barter with for five coins. Try to hurry. I have to leave it for the five minutes. Thanks, a bundle. Oh, we're, at, we're being timed already on the first level? What? Okay, where is she? Where is the lady? Where is the lady? Oh, here she is. Oh, I see. I have five coins. Let me see here. There's a guy on the cliff who loves smoothies. Oh, it's like a domino effect. Oh, man. He should be able to trade this blender for something else. Good luck. Oh, darn. Okay. This guy probably shouldn't need to be saved right now, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Why? He, does he not feel water being splashed on him? He should know I'm trying to save his life. Hey, right, come back! Get a blue coin? He does. Okay. It was worth it. Alright, where's this guy at? I don't know where he's at. Uh, oh boy. I'm not- Oh, here he is. Man, I really wish I had a blender. I have a blender! What? Didn't she give me the blender? Ma'am! I 
I thought she gave me a blender. But you didn't... Oh, I gotta take the blender with me. Oh, darn it. Well, that's not... That was not smart on my end. That's a, that's actually pretty upsetting. Wow, thanks for the blender. Here, you can have this box. It's full of stuff I'm sure anyone would want. In fact, there is a guy nearby who would love this. What? There's another guy? Oh my god. Do I gotta carry another box? Okay. Is he down there? Oh my god, I hate time missions. Definitely not something I particularly enjoy. Is that him? No, that's a conductor. Oh, where is this guy at? This is a problem. Back when I was a kid, I was never good at hide and seek, so this is kind of like reflecting on my past now. If I don't make this, I'm gonna have to search around. This is pretty embarrassing. Wait, I didn't even get a chance to look around. That's a timed mission on on the first one? That's a little excessive. Since when can Mario climb with items in hand? It's not like I made that big of a difference anyway. What? Oh my god, this is not happening. There's a golden bird. He has a shine sprite. I don't understand. I can't find the guy. Like, I know where the first two people are. Now I just gotta find the last guy. I don't know if he's the last guy, but he's a guy. Oh, well, I know where these people are now. I say that as I went completely the wrong way. And I know to take the blender with me this time. Yeah, I know where he's at now. Is that last? Is that other guy I couldn't find? Damn. Take this with me this time. You know what's interesting is I never owned a blender on my own until like just recently like i've lived on my own for about four years now almost four years and i have never owned a blender up until like a few months ago and i've only used it to make milkshakes and that's about it that's all that's all the only time i've used it was making milkshakes Okay, he's by like two wall looking things. Okay, where would those be? Oh, I think he's over there! I think he's up there. I might be able to make it still. He's right here! I might be able to make it still. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, where's the guy? Where's the guy? Oh no, I didn't make it. It's a good thing they call these learning curves. It would have been nice if they would have given us a mission or two that could have, like, kind of introduced us to the level more, though. Because this is kind of like hide-and-seek in an area you've never played hide-and-seek in before. <laughs> Look at that! You're much easier to find now. 
I do like that they were like, here, trade this for this, trade that for that, and then you get a big, jig, big giant speaker. Honestly, I would want the speaker. I really would. I grab this blue coin real quick. Buddy, huge speaker. It even has subwoofers. Ooh, subwoofers are nice. Yes, sir. Give me the shine. Give me the shine. Yes, sir. All right, next one, climbing the Erto Peak. Well, we at least get like to explore a little bit now, so that's nice. I wanna check out the area. I don't like feeling rushed to check out an area. So that way it takes you down to Delfino, it looks like. That's pretty cool. So, in the last episode, I kind of felt bad for only showing the regular missions. But I was like, eh, you know what? I should probably get some shine sprites first. That'd probably be the best way to start this LP. Oh, there's red coins there. Um, I thought maybe showing off the uh, missions, like the original missions first before getting into the newer stuff might be more exciting. Um... Hopefully, you guys were okay with that. Oh! That was another shine. Did I skip a mission? I probably skipped a mission. But I, I also wanted to see if anything in the main uh, missions did change. And they kind of did. To where you can get shines and not have to exit levels. Except in certain situations. Um... But you know, I thought, I thought that was cool that they did that. I kind of wish Nintendo did that back in the day. That would have made more sense. But I also see why they didn't, because they were like, wanting to make sure you knew where all the shiny sprites were in the missions. So it kind of made sense that they, did, that they did it this way, or that way. Oh, wow. But yeah, I like how they do it now. So is that a secret shiny sprite too? Hopefully I'm in the right place. I'm not. The red coins are kind of scattered pretty cool though. Okay, I need to time this like good here. Oh, I just got it. Oh, blue coin, nice. I was thinking it might be another shine, but... Also, those yellow triangles look like Triforces. I didn't know we were playing Zelda and Mario Sunshine. Holy crap, maybe I'll find the hook shot here! <laughs> Dumb joke, I know. So, our main objective is to climb the peak of this place. Should be easy enough. I'm a, I'm a pretty decent explorer -y kind of guy. So we have to go up top here. It looks like. <laughs> Ooh, Mario! Why didn't you triple jump? Okay, even with triple jump, it didn't work. Try doing this. Oh, I think I need a rocket nozzle. Right, I guess. Put this blue coin while we're at it. Got it. Is there a rocket nozzle around, though? There might be. I think I ran past one earlier. I feel like the only way to get up there is by using the rocket nozzle. 
it's not really giving me the option to get it, so how am I gonna get that shine? What does he have to say? I've been stuck up here for an hour now. I got scared of taking the first zipline down, and now I'm too chicken to go the rest of the way. I'll be get over my fear soon because I have no water up here. I thought homeboy was gonna help me. This tree is so tall. I still don't get how I'm supposed to get the shine without the rocket nozzle. The rocket nozzle is the only way I can get up there from what it looks like. And I'm not seeing another box. Yeah, that one's kind of... Wow. Um, I guess for now, I guess for now we'll go back and try a different level because I don't fully know how to do this without the rocket nozzle. And I don't want the, I don't want the video to be just focused on that. <laughs> Oh, wow. Ah. Oh. Right, we're gonna do a secret level now. Let's get some of these secret shines out of the way just so we can say we got more shines this episode. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's amazing how many people, like, will screw this level up. I don't really have any issues with this level. I think going back to that level when we have Rocket Nozzle fully unlocked might be, like, the best bet, if I'm being honest. Because of that cliff being so high, I'm not really sure how else we could, like, really do it. Alright. Um, we're actually gonna go back to the beach area of the lighthouses. And I can get this shine now, I believe. So we're gonna grab that. Grab, grab that, that. So how long have you guys played Mario Sunshine for? For all my... Mario fans out there. Have you guys, uh, have you guys ever played Sunshine? And if, if so, have you ever 100% completed it, or just completed it enough to where you beat Bowser? I've only completed it once, like, 100% completed it. But any other time, I've, uh, any other time, it was just to beat Bowser. Because <laughs> the blue coins are always hard to find where they're at. Music just faded out. I wonder if the music's like bugged a little bit. All right, we're gonna grab this blue coin here. Nice, we got 28 blue coins. How many blue coins do we have here? We have three. <clears throat> and there's 20 in Delfino Plaza? Okay, so that's like involving birds or whatnot. All right, and we're gonna spray this up. Take care of this, PD boy. Wakey, wakey. Is this guy made of oil? The other guy was made of chocolate pudding, so is this guy made of oil? I can't think of any black foods besides olives and black licorice. Which I hate both, by the way. Olives are just disgusting. And black licorice never tasted good. I don't like licorice as a whole. Licorice I can like... I can have licorice, like I'm not gonna be like, Ugh, gross, never. It's not bad. It's not my like... 
first go to, you know what I mean? All right, well, we got Rika Harbor open. Uber returns. Okay. We're not going to do this one yet. Also, I'm curious to know what other levels, like, what other new levels are available. I'm also curious if there's, like, a way in Gelato. If, if there's, like, another way that we can go to get to another level. So let's go to Gelato. <clears throat> Dune Bud Sand Castle Secret. Nice. Alright, so... I don't mind Delato Beach. All I know is that when I did my Versus in Connect 4, that we did this... We overdid this level, and it, like, kind of made me not want to continue doing this one. I'll eventually do it. I just want to see if there's a secret that we can go that takes us to another area. I'm still kind of exploring. It don't seem like it. So I wonder if the main levels like Bianco, Rico, and um, Gelato are like connected. Kind of genuinely curious about that now. And like all the other ones are just not. I just have like this weird theory, but I also could be wrong. I just haven't seen another one yet. Wait, is that a new level? Can we get over there? There's Bowie's. <laughs> Grab this blue coin. Can we actually get over there? That'd be pretty sick if we could. Oh, we can! Oh, what is this? What? So it looks like we can go to Peanut Park. Whatever that area is. So this is the only two? And it's Serena. I want to check this out. Can I not go over that way? What? Is this just like view? Can I not actually go over there yet? Oh, Lighthouse Island. Oh, that's how you get there. A stormy rampage. Okay. Ooh. A rainy level. I like it. And I think that way takes us to Pina Park. Whoa. So we can't kill him with regular water. This gives off Mario Odyssey vibes, if I'm being honest. Hey, main. Hey, you, I need your help. As a keeper of this lighthouse, it is my duty to keep it safe. However, when I left for my sun-drenched lunch break, something strange broke into the lighthouse. And to add it onto it all, it created all this horrible weather. Please, for the sake of my lunch, I mean the lighthouse, <laughs> stop the intruder and bring back the sunshine. Thanks, a bundle. Oh, so I'm going inside the lighthouse. Whoa! Holy crap!
Try diving into it. Oh, so I gotta dive into it when it gets to the ground. So I gotta wait for it to get to the ground? I gotta see where he's diving. Oh, crap. Oh, God. Where is he? Hurry, use your ground pound. Okay. Excellent. Oh, God. I'm almost dying. God, these guys have red eyes. Okay, gotta hurry. Is that it? Oh god, he's faster. Whoa! Gotta move. Give me the shine. Give me the shine. Yes, sir. <laughs> Shining atop the beacon. <clears throat> that boss fight wasn't too bad. I actually enjoyed that boss fight. Ah, look at that. Hey, look how happy everyone is. Hey, buddy. Want to take a ride across a panel? To Peter Pan? Nah, thanks so. This music's pretty interesting. This place looks so nice at, in the in the daytime. I gotta find the lighthouse guy again. I wonder where he is. I wonder if he's near the big lighthouse. Huh? That's so cool. A secret area that might actually cause me trouble besides Chucksters. Wow. Game over? I had zero light. Oh, wow. That's embarrassing. That is embarrassing. I gotta go all the way back. I don't want to go all the way back. <laughs> oh, man. Guess I'll take out this goopy thing and get back there. Give back the lighthouse. I think the music's a tad glitched. There's no toad here. Yeah, fire. I never understood what these things were called. Nice try. All right, we're gonna do this mission and then we'll call it an episode. In the next episode, we'll focus on the lighthouse area. I don't think we'll be able to get the rocket nozzle unlocked until we get Peach Save. I really don't think we're supposed to do that mission yet until we get Peach Rescued first. That's just my theory. I could be wrong, but that's just my theory. I think Peach has to get kidnapped, then we gotta go to Peanut Park, and then we can start unlocking, like, the turbo nozzle and the rocket nozzle and all that. 
So, I guess we'll save that mission until we get that unlocked? Possibly? But there's still a lot for us to explore anyway, and we'll be seeing new missions as we keep continuing this let's play anyway. So, it's not like I'm avoiding any of the new levels, because I really want to play the new levels. I think... I think I'm just kind of like playing it safe instead. Which, there's nothing wrong with that, guys. <laughs> Plus, we got like, what? Seven shines out of this episode? I think that's cool. Alright, yep. This is where we're going to end the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you guys did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. And, as always, I've been Trevor Neff, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Dude, I was trying to end my- I was trying to end my video. Oh, that's a big tree. I was trying to end my video, okay? Ah, So rude. Yes, I understand. <laughs> Alright, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.